It is that time again to see some more open homes with Elaine Burkett from Mike Pira of Real Estate. Hello, Elaine. Hi. Lovely to have you here. You had a good week? Great week, thanks. What are you doing the weekend? Going to some open homes? Oh, heading away to the beach. Oh, nice. Are right. nice. we well, starting to see more houses come onto the market now? Because I know that it sort of does get a little bit busier, doesn't it? Is yeah, it does. Look, and the warm weather will be really helping as well. People like to sell in spring and into summer. Mm. Go and like, what is it? <coughs> Kick some tyres and stuff, but on homes, the equivalent of that. <laughs> so, what's our theme for today? So, we've got some homes that have been renovated. They're all 70s or 80s homes, really beautifully presented. Some of them have some staging in them as well. Awesome. I love 70s homes. Mm. So, the first one is an item. Yeah, so this one ticks all three boxes for location, location, location. And it's right within the education zone of Christchurch. So we've got walking distance to the College of Education, Canterbury University, just around the corner from Avonhead School. So mm. position is king here. Gorgeous um, living areas, they all face due north, so maximising sun and warmth. And we've got an original kitchen there, but updated appliances, and mm. it looks beautiful with that wooden, um, you know, cabinetry, and then that crisp bench. Wow! Isn't it funny how sort of those styles have come around yeah. again. Like yeah. you can actually, that that looks pretty cool, pretty chic for yeah, now. Yeah, it is definitely. So it's quite a good size for a three-bedroom property, and it sits on a nice um, 560 square metre section, which is TC1 land, mm. which is the favourable land yeah. down there. So that means unlikely with liquefaction if there's future earthquakes. Mm. Um, full fence section and it's got established gardens as well. Oh, that's and nice. It's a great part of town, you know, central, you know, we've got the mall just mm. down the road if you've got kids at uni, um, all of that. So just one of the beautiful suburbs in Christchurch. Absolutely. Nice. So what kind of price are we talking for that one? So that's going to auction and a little bit different here where we've got the owner who's declared the reserve of 550000 mm. Oh, wow. OK. Yeah. Good to know, though. Very cool. Good. Now, sticking in Christchurch, we'll cross town to mm -hmm. Hoon Hay. What have you got yeah, for Yeah, we've us? got a delightful home that will suit um, a growing family or perhaps first home buyers. Mm. So immaculate condition again. It's been renovated. It is a 1970s build, so we've got really good bones there. But again, look at those flo floors. It's just got really clean lines and everything, and you could do what you like with it, not that it looks like it needs anything. Yeah, and perfect indoor-outdoor flow. Look all at that, that sun. Yeah, mm. all that beautiful sun. It's obviously got the right aspect there. You've got a heat pump and a log fire in the living room, so you've got year-round comfort. Good-sized kitchen and the dining area that flows interconnecting through to the um, living space. It's got three generously sized bedrooms. It's a really beautiful home. I, I just can't get over those floors actually because it's quite a luxury to have mm. a feature like that. And yeah. as you say, those bedrooms are quite generous. Really aren't they? easy care. And yeah, those kind of timbers are really hard to come by these mm. days. So if you can um, take off carpet and, and rejuvenate them, you've got something really special. Yeah, that's what I love. Awesome. And in terms of price, what are we sort of looking at on that one? So it's going to deadline sale and we're expecting interest in the 400s. Okay, so good to know. Cost effective, yeah. Mm. So let's head up to Wellington then, Broadmeadows. Yeah, and this is a uh, beautifully redecorated property. Um, it's positioned to enjoy glimpses of the harbour as well, so quite close to the city. Look, it's got some special features. They've got coved um, ceilings and contemporary finishes throughout, and it does have that nice little delightful outlook. Mm. Um, and beautiful open plan living. So upstairs we've got living in the kitchen and on the lower level are the bedrooms and the bathroom. So good separation there. Oh, nice, great. yeah, nice modernised kitchen. And, you know, I like that there's natural light coming into the kitchen as so well. So bright, isn't it? Yeah, I love that, can... yeah, all of these houses you've given us, whilst they are, you know, slightly older style, they've got no features that make you go, oh, mm. I have to do something with that. You know, that, that's really good bones. Yeah, they're great. So wow. um, it's it's yeah got the modernised bathroom here and downstairs there's a good um, flat lawn area which is good yeah. in Wellington if you've got a bit of a flat land. Um, there's a carport as well for car parking. Wow. Excellent. So what sort yeah. of price indication do we have for that one? Buyers in the 600s should inspect that. Okay. Fantastic. And the beautiful Browns Bay in Auckland. Yeah, now this is really centrally located between Rothesay Bay and Browns Bay. So wonderful position there right in the hub of the bays. Mm. Um, it It'll capture sun, hopefully it'll capture your heart too. Um, and there's some great views from this house. So it's spread over two levels and it'll be the perfect family home. Um, so if you want to be in a nice area where you can enjoy all that relaxation time as well, there's great walks nearby. It's very close to the beach um, or walkways around the cliff top round to Browns Bay, Murray's Bay, Myrangi Bay. So really well positioned. You've got Browns Bay Primary School and Zone and also Rangatoto College. Well, look at the size. I'm just overwhelmed by the size because, you know, mm. 
people think <coughs> in Auckland you might need to sacrifice that, but you've got massive size there, and anyone I know who lives in some of those eastern bays just absolutely adores living yeah. there. So. It's and it's you know beautiful. it's immaculately immaculately presented. Yeah, you can see how close it is to the beach there mm. too. Yeah, yes, right. just down so the road. So, in terms of a, a kind of price indication on that one, what are you thinking? It's by negotiation in the high nine hundreds. Right. Excellent. Hey, good stuff, Elaine. Thank you so much. Thanks. Always a pleasure having you in here, looking at open homes, and to see more on these properties and others, you can go to mypero.com.